Welcome back to Toy Thomas presents a Google Drive How To. This is Google Drive How To 5 of 10. This is lesson 3.2 and let's tour the drive some more. We're going to be working in Chrome. You can use whatever browser you're most comfortable with. We're already in the Drive app and we're going to be looking down the middle of the screen under the search bar and we're going to be looking at the body of the web page. So the first thing we see is My Drive with the drop down, and this has the same options as the Add icon. On the same line to the far right, you will see the View icon, and this lets you choose how you view your folders and files. As um, this is the grid view, you can change it to a list view, but I prefer the grid view. Next, we have the details icon, and you click to see details about your files and view your minute-to-minute -minute activity in the app. So your details would be here, and this is your minute-to-minute -minute details that happen in the app. All right, so then you would go down under My Drive, you now see folders. This is where folders will appear. You can drag and drop folders into other folders to, to easily create subfolders. <laughs> uh, let's see, which one might have an example of that? Yes, this is, has a bunch of subfolders. Yeah, so I'm going to come back here. Um, you can organize, um, your folders will organize themselves automatically, alphabetically, as you create new ones. If you want to control the order of your folders, consider numbering them. And as you can see, I've numbered some of them and some of them I haven't, just to show you that example. You can also color code your folders if you want. Let's look at other options available for organizing folders by right clicking on the folder on a folder. Um, however, we will explore these options later. So I can right click on the folder. I've got lots of options here but I can also change the color if I want to color code the folder. And we will look at some of the other options later. Under folders, you will find files. This is where any files not attached to a folder will appear. You can drag and drop files to move them into a folder if you want. So again, let's look at some of the options for um, organizing files by right-clicking on it. And of course, we will explore those options a bit later. So these are some of the options available, and we will explore those a bit later. All right, so yes, this one was a short one. <laughs> um, I, I do hope you're getting something out of it. Uh, again, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't be afraid to share it if someone else might find it helpful. I'll continue posting these on Tuesdays and Thursdays, so please consider subscribing and giving a thumbs up so that you receive notifications. Again, I apologize about the comments. They are an exclusive feature for my patrons, and um, if you'd like to leave me a comment, you can check my About page, you can visit my website, or you can become part of my community at the Creator or Tribe level. Until next time, this is Toy saying stay safe and be blessed.